Hello everyone, in this video I am going to discuss bearing and serving and also different systems of bearing will be discussed. Bearing is just another name of angle in serving but that angle is to be measured from some reference line and that reference line is usually the north line or the south line. There are different systems of bearing like one system is a whole circle bearing system and another is the quadrantal bearing system that is also called reduced bearing system. Now let's discuss whole circle bearing system. We know the standard directions. In whole circle bearing system the angle is always being measured from north reference line the one which is being represented with the red line and in whole circle bearing system the angle is always being measured clockwise since the angle is always being measured from north and it is always being measured clockwise therefore the range of that angle will always be from 0 to 360 degree now as far as the representation of a bearing of a line is concerned the bearing of the line in a whole circle bearing system is to be represented as for example if that line lies in the northeast quadrant the angle should be from 0 to 90 degree let's say that the, the line lies here and that angle makes it is 50 degree so representation is just the degree symbol along with the angle similarly if the line lies in southeast quadrant then the angle would be from 90 to 180 degree let's say that the line is over here then the angle would be let's say 120 degree and if that angle exceeds 180 degree then the quadrant would be southwest quadrant and in that quadrant the angle will vary from 180 to 270 degree and let's say that the line is over here and that line makes an angle of 200 degree and if the bearing of the line exceeds 270 degree then the line will lie in northwest quadrant and in that quadrant the range is from 270 degree to 360 degree let's say that the line is lying here and the angle that it makes with the north clockwise is 300 degree now this is all from whole circle bearing system now let's discuss about the quadrantal bearing system the same reference lines in quadrantal bearing system the angle can be measured from north or south whichever is near so angle can be measured from north angle can also be measured from south depending upon the location of the line if the line is nearer to south then the angle would be measured from north and if the line is nearer to south then angle would be measured from south and angle in quadrantal bearing system the angle can be measured clockwise or counterclockwise like clockwise from north clockwise from south anticlockwise from north or anticlockwise from south and if this is so then angle will always range from 0 to 90 degree if the angle is to be measured from north to east the angle would be from 0 to 90 if that line exceeds the 90 degree then that line would be in southeast quadrant then south would be nearer to that line and then bearing would be measured from south if we are on northwest quadrant the angle would be always 0 to 90 and same is the case if we are in southwest quadrant now as far as the representation of the bearing and quadrantal bearing system is concerned the angle is being represented with the quadrant in which that particular line is lying for example if that line is lying in northeast quadrant so ne should be written along with the angle similarly if the line lies in southeast quadrant then along with the angle se should be written and if the line lies in southwest quadrant then along with the angle southwest is to be written same is the case when the line lies in northwest quadrant the nw is to be written along with that angle so this is all from the introduction to the bearing and introduction to the different systems of bearing in next coming videos i will be discussing about the interconversion of different system of bearing like how we can convert one system of bearing to another system of bearing if the angle is given in quadrantal bearing system 
then how you can convert into whole circle bearing system and vice versa is also to be discussed in next coming videos. Thank you for watching this video.